What's up, YouTube? We're back at AC Games, and you know what time it is. It is time to crack Rise of the Duelists, the new set. Before we get started, we're gonna have a giveaway. I'm gonna throw it to myself and include that giveaway because I don't have it here with me. And for today's giveaway, we'll be including the three super rare guys from Rise of the Duelist, along with this pack of sleeves, international watchers you may have to pay for shipping if you want the sleeves as well because they might have to go as a parcel. So if you don't want them and you just want the cards, just let me know in the comments. All you have to do to enter leave a like subscribe and comment what's your favorite card from this set and we're back without further ado let's jump right into it before we do that actually though just a little announcement what's coming up in the 900 sub special along with another box of rise of the duelist we're going to be opening up code of the duelist return of the duelist duelist revolution soul of the duelist power of the duelist and the almighty the epic Duelist Genesis First Edition. So make sure you stay tuned for that and stay subscribed and get subscribed because only 42 subscribers, I believe, at the time of this opening. I mean, Let's also go. stay subscribed. And stay subscribed. Yeah, please don't unsubscribe. I would love that. <laughs> Anyways, without further ado, let's jump right into this. Again, we're just going to be cracking Rise right now. Eh, get in there. Finger. But... I believe I should be able to <laughs> I should be able to open up. Uh, you should be able to see everything by next week. Hopefully we get to 900 by then. But I'm hoping, I'm really hoping we pull a Gaia. That would be my favorite pull Shuffle right the here. packs. Shuffle them? They're matched. Huh. Interesting. If you go down one column and you hit a secret rare, the matching pack on the other side has the other secret rare. Okay, all right. Uh, interesting, Tom. Okay, here we go. Shuffling Just them to, up. Just you know, add some suspense. Adding some suspense. No mapping will happen here. I was going to ask you that before we got the packs, actually. I was like, are they mappable? Are the boxes mappable? The, bo the boxes are very mappable. Ooh. Okay. I'd say up to like 95% okay. at least. So you just, you, you took them out and just mixed them up? Yep. Okay. All right. All right, Calvin. Next time, get me the one with the starlight, please. Oh, I, saw, <laughs> I said the boxes are mapped. I didn't say the cases are mapped. Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right. Beauty, beauty, beauty. Okay, so without okay, further ado. No, the ready? cases can't be mapped. Starlights are one in every two cases. Okay, so you don't so know which. So even if you get one from a case, right? You don't know which case. Exactly. Okay, that's good to know. All right, let's jump right into it. Go ahead. You can uh, crack a pack while I crack one. I have still yet to pull a starlight rare here, Calvin. Are we going to pull our first today? I'm going to tell you right now, it took me two cases to crack my first one. I do not want to open two cases, guys. Okay, first pack, Starlight Rare. Here we go, baby. Oh, yeah, the Melfies, they're uh, getting some support here, right? <laughs> Melfi puppy. Kind of nice how low rarity all their cards are. Yeah. It's uh, good for casual players. Hey, Linker Bell. That's a funny card. Another Melfi. DD Dog. DD Dog. Uh, not, not, there's no crazy commons in this set? Nope. Awesome. Commons, toss those away here. New sets are just like that. Commons are all 25 cents. Even the good awesome. ones like Parallel Elixir. Nemesis Keystone. Oh, I guess because there's so many, right? And there's yeah. no, do they, do they stop short print? Uh, allegedly. Allegedly, okay. Interesting. Uh, th there's like people saying both ways right now. Uh, one guy bought a case or four cases and only pulled one droplet. So use that as justification huh. that droplets short printed. Interesting. Then a guy shows up with a 20 case ratio and is like, no, it's not short printed and kind of just. Huh. Okay. I'm fairly sh uh, sure that Rise of the Duelist is not short printed. Ah, okay. Dogmatica, hopefully we pull a nice Dogmatica. And hey. a bit of trivia behind that is Konami actually was forced by European law to stop short printing. Oh, no way. Because it's uh, something to do with Euro Europe's gambling laws. Because if you short print, then you're uh, effectively, oh, sticking out. Uh, you're effectively controlling the ratios of product or something like that. Uh, yeah, I know. I feel like it's almost like false advertising type of thing. Like, Oh yeah, definitely. Right? If you say something, I, and, that's, and I feel the same with like older sets not having certain secrets, certain right. codes, not having certain secrets. Same with hobby. It's like false advertising. Like, you can't say ultimate rares come in this set unless you disclose. A okay, Blizzard. Blizzard's actually a pretty good super rare. No, I'm not sure about value, but there's some hype about it since okay. it lets you play around stuff like Dark Ruler no more. Interesting. I have no idea what that card does, but... <laughs> um, <laughs> it, it locks down your opponent's entire board and they can't respond to it with monster effects. Interesting. Blizzard. With new uh, Flame Noble Knights. 
Hey, our first ultra rare. That's not too shab. What is that? What's that name? Uh, Sella Glare, the Luminous Lunar Dragon. Awesome. All of the sets are card names in the set are kind of crazy. Kind of weird. Like right there, the one you just passed. Curse of Dragon, the Cursed Dragon. Yeah. <laughs> That's like, um, hey, Gaia, the Fierce Knight Origin. It's pretty cool. Pretty cool super. That, it reminds me of uh, like a lot of the cards that were printed in Bilar, right? Yeah. Like uh, the Dark Metal Dragon, the Darkness Metal Dragon, whatever that is. And also Dark Armed, the Dark Armed Dragon, or whatever the heck that is. Oh! Hey, triple T, we go, baby! For secret and We the... will take it! Awesome! There we go. I always, like, with boxes, I always pull the worst secrets. So uh, I'm just like, I'm happy to get one. This is the best secret rare from the set there as of go. filming. There we go. Awesome. Okay. And the, okay, no, no, we did have the ultra. Okay. Forgot about that. I was like, is that our first? Oh, rise. First hollow? Okay. Yes. Rise being opened here, sir. The first of Dark Lord. Yeah, basically, for new sets, Rise of Duelist, Trinity Code, what it comes down to is commons, 25 cents, super rares, 50 cents. Awesome. Get my sleeves out here. Yeah, I'll probably get playing Noble Knight. I can't believe we pulled it. <laughs> I said, usually have pretty bad luck with, uh, with my secrets for boxes, so that's nice. See, if I grab you the box, <laughs> it, it cancels out. Oh yeah, this is, okay, yeah, you're right. This is your box. Yeah, Calvin picked out one box. I picked out the other. This is his that we're opening first. You'll make sure you check out mine in the 900 sub special. And make sure you sub to get there. If you guys want to take a look at this, just while Calvin's helping somebody out, look at this awesome mat. Check it out. Obelisk over here, was it Calvin? <laughs> He called this obelisk. He called. <laughs> he called. He called the uh, Exodia obelisk. You got that Exodia taking on Blue Eyes Ultimate Dragon. All right, ladies and germs, I'm gonna jump into one without Calvin here. We've got plenty, plenty of plenty of rise. He's not missing out on much unless we pull the Starlight. Ooh, Quacky Miru, Supplier, our second ultra rare. It's a pretty interesting looking card. We're almost finishing up on this side here. Last last pack, come take it, Calvin. Another uh, ultra, Quacky Miru, Supplier. Dogmatica Encounter, Fright Oh, yeah, Supplier is a really good card. Oh, is it? Yeah. Nice, okay, it's, awesome. It's uh, very playable and not Emancipator, one of the top decks right now. Nice. And Gaia, the Magical Knight. I do, I do appreciate how they're kind of going back and, you know, paying homage to the to the old the old guys, like, you know, oh, yeah. making new sets. With they them. made a uh, catapult artillery dragon or something. Oh yeah, yes. Oh, pretty good secret. Not right? too shabby. Okay, not too shabby. We'll take that. So, is it if you get two secrets, is it no starlight for sure? Or... No, uh, starlight oh, replaces still... the foil in any of the twenty four packs. Oh. Okay, I'll take that. That is very interesting. Yeah, there, there, there's still, still uh, some suspense left. Let's do it. Second secret rare pulled, though. So it's only two secrets for a box, right? Yeah. Of course, Calvin pulls them. What is this guy? How, how does he do this? He's got the magic fingers. As long as it's not my own <laughs> product. Hey, win the wind chance. So is that that's the uh, starlight, right? Yeah, that comes in starlight. Beauty. That's a pretty good card nice. and kind of underrated right now. Oh, really? It's okay. like two dollars a card. So you think it, it'll probably go up if you hold on to it? Oh yeah, for sure. Awesome. It's more than two dollar card. There we go. Our first Starlight Rare, guys. You can't see it. <laughs> Imagine. That'd be awesome. Okay, not too shabby. And uh, ratios for ultras is it four? Four, four per box. Still. Four? Have you ever have you gotten any weird ratios that like give you more the, or the, less? The or? last weird ratio box I had was Chaos Impact. Okay. I bought a box, it had three ultra rares okay. instead of four, and no that secrets. That happens, dude, that happens to me. I don't know why. <laughs> like, it's happened to me with um, uh, Crimson Crisis, Absolute Power Force. Okay, but you see, with Crimson Crisis, there was only ever one secret rare per box. That's the thing, and it and, and sometimes, I, I'm, I've heard it wasn't even guaranteed. Chaos so. Impact was supposed to have two, and I got yeah. zero. I had one. Exactly, that's, that's messed up. <laughs> that was actually... Uh, time. The, the day that I bought a case and a half. Because I just kept rage 
<laughs> just rage buying. Rage buying boxes. Okay, check this guy. This is an interesting little card. This is a palindrome. So you say if this is said, this is spelt the same way forward as it is backwards. This card. Okay, yeah. Oh, if you didn't know that. Ooh, there's a guy here, bro. I gotta keep the guys out. But it's a super rare. It's a super. That's basically bulk. <laughs> it's all right. I'll take it. It's a Gaia, man. We gotta show off the set. You gotta. They also made the cover card a super rare. Yeah, like that. I that's another thing I hate about. But 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 it comes in Starlight too. That's exactly that's the good thing. Like, um, uh, was it Rise of the Duelist? That cover card would be. This is Rise of the Duelist. Sorry, uh, re Rise. What I'm thinking of. Yeah. That one, I was like, yeah. Why is this cover card so cheap? And it's an ultra. Like, it's just it, they should make all cover cards should be Starlights. It's cheap because it's bad. <laughs> uh, that that does happen sometimes. That tends to. Uh, <laughs> Alrighty, alrighty. What are we down to? Final three here. Let's go. Where that starlight, baby? I have blizzard. Another blizzard. I'll take that. I'll lower this a little bit more so you can see a little bit better, Calvin. What are you trying to say? <laughs> He's six four, guys. Like I said. It's a dragon. <laughs> Come on, baby. What are you gonna open up? You gonna get some battles of legend or maybe, rise? Maybe a bit of both. A little bit of both. A couple of really good sets coming out. Uh, modern Yu-Gi-Oh! right now is really... Is the, really the Gold good. Series 10s are going to be so hype. Yeah, I've heard I've heard they're going to be better than the last Gold Series 10. Or... Uh, that's debatable. The, really? the last ones are really good because of the promos. Oh. I'm going to go to Gold's Forest. There's new Gold's Forest in that... The crappy duelist stone. Yeah. Ghost Rare Raw. Ghost Rare Raw. I then, wonder if they're going to bring it back, bring Ghost Rare back. No, no. Hey, Rico. That's it. It's so uh, trash that they had to bring. They had to do something to make sure it sells. The, the last. It wouldn't sell. Um, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't sell well. Just, I know it wouldn't sell well without that. Oh, uh, yeah. No, exactly. That's now, exactly Now it's going to be hype. That's I mean, what they're, so they're doing. Without that's it, what, it's not. It's not. It's like. That's what. Con second glance at it. Like, that's exactly what Konami's doing. They're like, let's put with one chase card in here so that like anybody even collectors will be interested yeah, because in because they said they weren't doing ghost for buying it and then they ate their words last pack magic baby is it the starlight ah ancient warriors oath for the last pack but pretty good box if uh, if i do say so myself i'd say this is the second best possible box without a starlight in it second best if possible this box. was replaced by a forbidden droplet you would have the best possible non-starlight box I'll take that, guys. I will take that. And that is not too shabby at all. A couple of nice, uh, let's go over a little little review here. A couple of nice supers, little blizzards. I think the super guys are nice. <laughs> you know what? Good for you. <laughs> <laughs> and we have some more bulk supers. I'm not going to go through them all, but a couple of our highlights for our ultras. These two are definitely playable. Um, and then, yeah. These guys definitely are best yeah, the ultras. The Miru is an excellent extender in Adamant's Fates. Beauty. Hear that, guys? Get your tips over here from Calvin. And of course, our secret rares, the highlight, Nadir's Servant and Triple Tactics Talent. Boom, I will take that. Definitely a nice box. Hopefully, my box has the starlight and I can beat Calvin there. <laughs> <laughs> hope pack you all battling with your own box. <laughs> exactly, pack battling myself. Anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed. Stay tuned for the next one and make sure you subscribe for that 900 sub special. Peace.